What lengths would you go to to save someone you barely knew? In my house, the Lemoyne House in Washington, Pennsylvania, we did whatever it took to save slaves we barely knew in the Underground Railroad. Hello, I'm Dr. Francis Lemoyne. I played a role in freeing slaves from the South by letting them hide in my house in Washington County. One of my favorite stories in our involvement in the Underground Railroad was one day I had heard of a group of about seven or eight slaves were coming through my friend's barn. He had asked me to check on them, so when I went to check on the group they were of slaves, they were nowhere to be found. So figuring they got caught before making it to the barn, I went home, least expecting where they actually were. I didn't know that the group of slaves was being tracked at the time. I finally arrived back home, finding them hiding under my bed. We were trying to figure out what to do with the group, when the slave agents came bursting through the door looking for the group of slaves that had been tracked right to where we were, in my house. My wife supporting me in my quest to help people had pretended to be deathly ill, staying in bed for days. The agents being southern gentlemen would not dare disturb my wife, the lady of the house, in such an awful state. This act of bravery by her saved that group of slaves by hiding them under the bed she was in the entire time. She kept them from nearly getting captured and being taken back into slavery. My wife and I tried to save as many people as we could from the terrors of slavery, but this is my favorite story of how we accomplished just that.